Today we're playing Modern Warfare 3 Zombies and Bingo at the same time? We have a bingo card of various items in Modern Warfare 3, and we're gonna see how many bingos we can get in just one game. Let's get started. Oh my goodness, I am so excited for today's video, beautiful people. This is an idea I've had for a decent amount of time. I have to give credit where credit is due. I saw, what was it called, with friends? Ooh, death perception can, let's go, brain rot. I think it was their channel name is With Friends. Amazing channel, super fun to watch. They have a great bingo series. And so as you can see on screen, we've got a bingo card here with a lot of different things we can cross off. Now this bingo card is completely customizable. Right now I went, I went with mainly mostly like items that we can have in our inventory, but there's other things like max ammos and we can even change this to mean certain actions like take out mercenary camp and triple pack a punch a gun from the beginning of the of the match here. Ooh, but here you go. For example, this is a wrench here that we found so we can cross off wrench and I'm going to start this contract, which should, because we're playing solo, give us a guaranteed self revive, which is going to be really, really good. Dang it. I was looking for some aspirin here. Oh, gas mask. Let's go. We got gas mask. Now, this being the very first time we're trying this death perception, let's go. I know there's going to be a little bit of tweaking that we need to do here. And and it might be a little bit weird for you to see somebody doing this solo because this sort of thing does lend itself to a collaboration a little bit better. Let's go aspirin. <laughs> Clearly, we might need to make things a little bit more difficult based on what we're finding out this game. But hey, that's why we're trying it out. That's what we're doing here. All right, we've got ourselves our self revive and a PhD flopper can. How lucky is that? We've got a PhD can and self revive, meaning we only need to find a medium rucksack and we've got our first bingo. Now, clearly anything that you bring into the match does not count. So as you can see, there is something, there is a legendary weapon here. However, I'm not going to count the one that I have or the legendary tool that I used because, you know, I spawned in with it. But what I want to do, I really, really, really want to get to the other side of the map here because I know just the place that's going to have the medium rucksack that we're looking for. I think this is a very interesting way of keeping Mono Warfare three zombies a little bit more fresh and I think it's gonna make for a pretty entertaining video hopefully hopefully but let's see the portals around here somewhere we're gonna go here here and here let's go let's go we are at pop off power okay that was that was an interesting little thing that happened oh my goodness would you look at that would you look at that the very very first thing that we open has a medium Rucksack, we got our first bingo. Now there are gonna be a couple things that are more difficult to find clearly that a legendary tool, epic tool, triple pack a punch crystal, even the, uh, the single pack a punch crystal, gonna be pretty interesting for us to find. Ooh, but before we leave, before we get out of here, let's try looking for a three plate vest over here. Also, I'm pretty sure I saw a stun grenade earlier, though there's another medium rucksack, let's go. Ooh, comic book, let's go, that's a comic book done. Picture of a man, dang it, picture of a man, I need to be looking at those. Come on, three plate vest, three plate vest. Ooh, first edition, I'll take that instead. Now, I, I, don't, I don't think, ah, oh, picture of a man, I don't think we need to uh, like have these in our inventory to count Oh, look at that, a rare ether tool. So I don't need to like hold the aspirin or whatever, just need to find it. And I was going to say, at least for this one, look at that stun grenade. Look at that stun grenade. We might go for blackout this game. We might go for blackout. If we get lucky with some tier three contracts, maybe kill some mega abominations. Ooh, this could be a fun one, except I brought in this terrible, terrible weapon here. This is the KVD Enforcer. I'm doing this because I thought it would be a good idea to do this sort of thing with uh, the weapons that I need to get Zircon scale and the camel grind and all that stuff because I thought, oh, I'll be strolling around tier one, tier two. I didn't know I would be going into tier three trying to look for legendary tools so quickly. However, it's not uncommon for tier two contracts to give me some legendary tools when I'm feeling lucky. I'll throw up the class that I'm using for this KVD enforcer, but it's just basically movement speed and aim down sights time. It's nothing special. Lots of these marksman rifles are pretty garbage, so when people ask me, hey, what's a good weapon? I say, just don't use sniper rifles or marksman rifles because they're, they're not great. And maybe we'll go into tier three and show you why. But man, if we could get lucky here with like a pack a punch crystal or better yet, even a schematic, maybe. Are you freaking kidding me? 
We got ourselves an epic ether tool. Oh, I don't need an epic ether tool, do I? No, I don't. I need an epic weapon. Now, again, this being like the pilot episode of this series, what we could say is we could say that I could go buy a weapon off of the wall now and then go apply this uh, legendary tool to it in order for it to count, which I think I'm definitely going to do here just to see how easy it is. I just want to see how easy it is. That way I can kind of twi um, tweak the difficulty if I really want. To. Now, this might be the first time in a long time that this specific contract gives me some trouble just because of the gun that I'm using currently. All right, there you go. You guys had your fun now. These marksman rifles, I think, do a good amount of critical damage, but it's just the rate of fire, the semi-automatic nature of them just makes them not super great to use. What I need from you beautiful people is a little bit of feedback on the video. First of all, do you even like this idea? Second of all, what sorts of things should we add onto the bingo card? Because like I said, we could do certain actions too, like defeating Stormcaller or defeating one of the Axe story missions, activating the secret 115 Easter egg song. You know, we could do a whole bunch of things or something completely random, like stay up in the air for like a thousand meters or something, you know, little challenges within the game. All right, maybe we'll get lucky with a purple. Nope. All right, cool. All right. Now maybe we'll get lucky with a schematic. Ooh, speed cola can. Dang it. All right. Now I do want to double pack a punch this weapon that I've got, but for First, we have to, we have to get this epic LSW, which is like genuinely not bad here without any pack-a-punch. Wow. Now, in terms of things like the sentry gun, mortar strike, things that you can purchase from the buy station, I think I'm going to allow it for this game, like I said, just to see how easy it can be, and then we can readjust the difficulty later. Also, is there really a photo of a dog in here, or did I just make that up completely? I know there's photos of other things, but now that I'm actually in here playing, I don't know if the photo of a dog actually exists or if it's like what we were seeing before the photo of the man and the photo of the woman but man it's getting me to look at everything Ooh, documents ah oh, so close so close man we were off to such a fast start here i've just realized we're 15 minutes in and we're kind of coming to a crawl here i gotta i gotta get lucky we might even go back do some tier one contracts in order to maybe get a better likelihood of the Pack-a-Punch 1 uh, crystals here. Oh, but there's a lot of stuff we can loot in there. Oh, I'm going in there afterwards for sure. And I'm sure, I'm positive I've missed things that you guys are gonna scream at me afterwards. I haven't memorized this bingo card either. Oh, I should say Frost Blast. I, I made a little oopsie there. Frost Blast, I meant Cryo Freeze. You cannot get field upgrades in here, but you can get ammo mods. Ooh, maybe we should do that next. We should go do some Ether Nest, get some Cryo Freeze, and Pack-a-Punch 1 crystal. Are you kidding me? Well, look at the luck. Look the luck i i should say if we buy um if we buy juggernaut or a perk can it does not count we have to get awarded it i am going to loot up here just because i really like looting up here but also because maybe over here i've got some inclination that these guys might have us a legendary weapon. Oh no, these someone's been here already. Bummer. So even if there was a legendary weapon, someone's probably already grabbed it. Still worth looking into. I think we still need a throwing knife. I think throwing knives are incredibly rare to, rare to find, aren't they? I think they are. Oh well, oh well, that's quite all right. That's quite all right. Let's go ahead and do this ether nest. Maybe we can get ourselves a cryo freeze. There we go. Oh, I'm missing one somewhere. Where am I missing one? I'm missing one back in here. Maybe, maybe. There we go. Nice, nice, nice. And there's our max ammo. Oh, you get a free max ammo at the end of those. I completely forgot about that. That's so lucky. Oh, this this gun is terrible, though. The, the semi-automatic's awful, awful. Can we get cryo freeze from our first one, though? Can we get it? Can we get it? And no. All right, that's fine. That's fine. I think next time, if we decide to do this again, I think instead of going for, like, the basic stuff, because there's a lot of basic stuff that I feel like is really common, I think I'll do the, like, uh, expensive things, like the rare things, like the... Uh, the yeah, these guys, the aged wine, the purified water, all that sort of stuff. I think that might make it a little bit more interesting. Having the regular wrench and the regular stuff in here is a little, oh, throwing knife, let's go, we got a throwing knife. I think it makes it just a little bit too easy. Except for, like I said, the photo of a dog. I, I really could have sworn there was a photo of a dog in here. <gasps> oh my goodness, oh my goodness, picture of a dog, picture of a dog. I knew it was real, I knew it was real, never doubted for a moment, let's go. <laughs> that is our second bingo, our second bingo. I really would have thought we've gotten more by now. Only 20 minutes left, we better start heading or thinking about tier three here. And we are right next to a mercenary camp, and I think all of this 
zombies that were spawning in were was getting distracted. Uh, we're getting distracted by the mercenary camp over there because this is the first first zombies I've been killing since we started this contract. All right, give me that uh, tombstone. Okay, I wish there was a schematic. Oh boy. Now, unfortunately, I didn't think we'd be in this position. I thought we'd have a lot more points. Uh, then we do, but we're getting towards the end of the game. If I want to run tier three schematics or tier three contracts, I've got to uh, pack a punch my weapon to, to pack a punch three, but that's not going to leave us with a lot of time. And that's not going to leave us with a lot of points so that we can buy anything else. But I think we have to do it. I think we got to go for it. And I think I'm going to get rid of this weapon too. We've got it, you know, and unfortunately we're going to need to triple pack a punch now. So we'll need to go to the dinosaur, the lion and then the pizza so we'll go here oh no we don't have enough to pack a punch after doing that donut you donut oh no oh boy that was a that was a dumb move that cost a thousand points donuts come on be smarter than that oh that's gonna cost me time all right all right i think i got a plan i think i got a plan i, I think we'll be all right i think we'll be okay we're just gonna need to get creative here with how we move throughout the map oh this is this is fun i don't know if it's fun for you to watch but man is it fun for me to play oh donuts you're such a donut Donut, why didn't you go to tier three first, Donuts? You could have done the triangles for the pack crystal and the tool. Oh man, y'all are gonna be so mad. Y'all are gonna be so mad. Why didn't I think of that? It's cause I never do it. It's cause I never do it. Oh man, and nothing. Okay, what a bummer. That's a bummer. Oh, oh, look at this. There's a pillar right here. Very good. So if someone wants to go to the unstable rift, they can. And now we get to use the most underrated vehicle of transportation here in Modern Warfare 3. These boats are awesome. Awesome. And I'm actually going to take a little bit of a longer route here. We're going to go all the way around this. Actually, no, no, this should be fine. This should be fine right here. And then we'll hop on up this good little midway between the pack a punch and where I actually want to go. We'll go ahead and triple pack a punch this guy. Ooh, they haven't opened this yet. Is there anything in this that I need? No. Okay. All right. And we can make our great escape right here. Very good. Oh, and there's already a boat here and a faster boat. How lovely is that? Okay. <laughs> now you might be thinking donuts. Where in the world are we going? Well, we are going to be going to get ourselves a gold skull. And the way we do that is by defeating Stormcaller. Defeat Stormcaller, maybe get a couple contracts for some schematics, maybe we get a jug, jug perk can. I really wanna come out of this with more than just one or two bingos here. Plus, I don't remember if I could buy the killstreaks in the tier two area, or we have to go into the tier three area. Uh, it's gonna be, it's gonna be risky. Plus, I don't know how many points they are. We're gonna need to point farm a little bit here, but we only have 10 minutes. This might go to the final exfil. And like I said, darn it, I wish I had done the crystals at the very beginning of the of the game here. All right, we have not a good weapon for this. Ooh, actually, not a not a bad weapon for the for the zombies though, at least, right? Like that's pretty darn good. All right, Stormcaller, let's see what you're made of. Hopefully, not much, but you're kind of tanky naturally. So let's do that. Let's throw an energy mine over here, so that way can maybe stun you for a little bit. Nope, all right, didn't stun you, that's fine. But honestly, not too bad. Honestly, not too bad. Don't you be healing off me. Don't you be healing off of me. There you go, there you go. Yeah, this might take a while. This might take a while. That's okay though, that's okay. Just train them around, just train them around. That's right, Stormcaller, that's right. You're halfway there, halfway there. Very good, come on, donuts. Ooh, good shots, good shots, donuts. Gotta keep an eye on our mask. Don't you be healing, don't you be healing, don't you be healing. No, 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 there you go. All right, let's head on back let's head on back let's head on back get another uh mask here maybe we can draw him closer to us get some pop shots when we're not in the storm all right it's a little bit closer he's a little bit closer here very good i'm good with that and you flew away and you flew away okay that's lovely well let's throw this guy down here maybe get us a little bit of time oh storm is going away come on storm collar go 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 let's go let's go and that is a gold skull and did i see what i thought i just saw i think i did i think i did we also got a three plate vest oh my goodness i got hit by lightning or like all those zombies at the same time without jug on three plate vest gold skull neither of those neither of those is a bingo are you kidding me we need to go do some tier two contracts real quick here like oh my goodness we need to go Ooh, and we need a cryo freeze a cryo freeze too oh my goodness all right speed run donut speed run speed run speed run let's go let's go i would really like jug right now as well jug would be nice like uh, just as a normal gameplay thing Ooh, there's a nuke right there all right come on cryo freeze cryo freeze let's go nice 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 another max ammo just in case that first one wasn't good enough for people still no more 
than two bingos. My goodness. Oh, buy station. Where's the nearest buy station down there? That's fine. That's where we're going anyway. I don't think we have enough time to go to tier three, but I think I have a great idea on how to uh, how to get ourselves a legendary weapon in the meantime. All right, come on, come on, give me a jug, give me a schematic. Neither, neither, you've given me neither. Oh my goodness, the streamer luck is over. All right, let's hope, let's hope we can get, what is it, a mortar strike and a sentry gun in here? I don't know if we can, mortar strike, sentry gun. <gasps> sentry gun, mortar strike, let's go, let's go, mortar strike, sentry gun. Now, I don't actually want those, I just needed to purchase them. So that is gonna be one, two more bingos, and not another bingo. Okay, ooh, and we got Zircon scale, let's go, very nice. All right, so yeah, you actually have to purchase them, so there you go, there's that. I thought that'd be too easy, but now we've got here, we've got less than 5k points now we could go to tier three and get a guaranteed legendary weapon on the wall or what we could do is something completely different first things first i'm gonna do another cargo delivery just in the hopes for a schematic slash uh, jug can and i hope it'll bring me over to this corner of the map here so that way we're away from the storm so we could do a little bit more contracts with the 15 minutes we got i'm like nervous i'm sweating this is like crazy man <laughs> If I had just done the triangles first things first, man, I could have gotten a whole blackout this game. Well, potentially, potentially, with some better luck too, with some better luck here. Maybe a little bit more optimization. I kind of killed some time earlier, you know, I could have been more optimal. I know I could have looked in tier three. I know there's a potential that somebody didn't do the triangles, but it would have taken too much time by the time I thought about it. And uh, you saw how many people were in tier three. I bet you all of them did the triangles. All right. Any schematic, any schematic, schematic or jug, schematic or nothing, nothing. Dang it, man. Dang it. That's so, so disappointing. But I still have hope we can get one more bingo. We are far late into the game, and usually the box is great at giving you legendary weapons at the end of the game here. So let's go ahead. 450 points. Come on. Give me that legendary weapon right off the bat. And. Okay, all right, that's epic. That's epic. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. It's an invisible haymaker. It's the new meta. Oh, there you go. Okay, come on, come on. Let's go, Ram 9. Ram 9. That didn't look like a Ram 9, but hey, it is a Ram 9. We got another bingo. And we still got some time. I think I could do these two contracts. Oh, I hope I could do these two contracts by the time the game's over. Oh, I have PhD flopper, didn't I? Yeah, I got PhD flopper. Why didn't I equip it? I was just so excited to get away at the beginning of the game. I was like, why am I taking fire damage from dogs? <laughs> All right, that's. That's it. That's it. Come on. Jug or schematic? I really think a schematic is going to be more likely than a jug at this point. And oh, elemental pop. Why did you? Oh, you tricked me. You tricked me. I got so excited. All right. I am going to clear out this mercenary camp here so that way I could take its ACV so that way I don't die from the thing. I think the final th uh, the final um, circle is going to be in the top left here this time around. Really should have done this one first. I think this uh, HVT shows up over here, huh? Yeah, I should have done this one first. Oh, another waste of time. Luckily, he should go down really, really easy with this thing. Triple pack a punch legendary. Yeah, there you go. There you go. All right, come on. Come on. Give me something good. Give me something good. Another elemental pop. What a troll. What a troll. Oh, man. All right. We got to we just got to make our way up to the top here. This final exfil. I don't think there's any other contracts that we can do. I mean, maybe that one if we get there, but it's going to take us a while to get there. Oh, man. We might have just ran out of time. Oh, and I'm sure I looked at a jug can or something something earlier ah, ah but it's time to go it's time to go well well yeah let's go up here let's go up here i think we could do maybe one of these guys i mean this has got to be where the final expo is it can't be down there it can't be it's got to be up in this corner we this is a, this is a smart play this is a smart smart play it's the last contract we have time for all right maybe there's a oh there's no fridge in here oh bummer the final the final expo music's kicking in oh man this is so stressful this is so stressful if i'm right the final expo should be just right there though Man, I really should have gone for the things that I knew how to get first. And then like at the end of the game, do all the like weird wrenches and look at all the different loot crates and all that stuff. Oh, man. What's strange, though, I, I noticed this. I did notice this, that uh, we only got a uh, max ammo from the uh, ether nest. We haven't actually got one from killing a zombie yet, which I found really strange. Come on. Yeah. Final X feels right here. Very good. Very good. Good decision. Donuts. Good decision. And yeah. 
I was going to go after this Atlas contract, but I don't think we had time to do it. Looks like the storm is just almost over there. So help me if this contract gets us a schematic, get us a schematic, get us a schematic, get us jug, give us something. Come on, come on, come on. And a pack a punch one crystal. What a lame ending. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like our fate is ultimately sealed. There's nothing left to do except go and wait for the final Xville. Unless we have nothing. Bummer. I, I'm, I'm really, I'm all out of ideas. That's it. That's it. We can always look for like fridges and stuff. This loot chest right here. This loot chest has jug in it. Watch this. Watch this. Check it out. Check it out. And oh, that would have been sick though. Wouldn't that have been sick? Oh, 78 seconds. It's the final countdown. Oh, this, this thing. Okay. All right. Well, oh, I guess it's time to go and get all of this horde of zombies. Look at this horde of zombies. Very nice. I guess you could also tax dance this guy, which really isn't bad, but I really like the precision and you got to be precise in order to get like maximum damage here three two one let's get on board oh dude that mangler spawned right there my goodness oh my oh my what a game so it looks like we got five bingos all together now if you're looking for a way to spruce up your modern warfare zombies experience be sure to check out this video and stay beautiful